Wednesday, we could have winds upwards of 45 miles an hour. New Center 7's Kayla McDermott is live in Greene County, where she talked with a tree cutting company about this weather heading our way. Kayla? Yeah, James, they said they're going to be out this week trimming trees just like these ones because when the winds get that intense, these branches can become dangerous. We get a lot of trees that uproot. This tree is concerning since it is set to do just that. There's a big limb that's causing the tree to be imbalanced. The lack of stability can become a major problem depending on the weather. The right strong wind after a rain, it could blow that tree up, it could uproot the tree into the barn. With winds possibly in the 40s this week, that limb had to go. Owner of 3-in-1 Tree Service, Stuart Motes, said this is not the only tree they've been called out for this week. He's actually moving clients up to beat the weather. We moved up some of our trimming, decreased the surface area so that when the wind's blowing, the wind blows through the tree and not up against the tree to where it makes it a little safer. Preventing any of those limbs from falling on a house, car, or someone else. Uh, we always respond to emergency requests like that. Now, Moats said the best thing people can do is be proactive and have their trees cut before any weather, since it's not a good idea for them to be working in a storm like that. It's not safe for anyone. Reporting live in Beaver Creek, Kayla McDermott, New Center 7.